Hi everyone, welcome back to Slate Secrets YouTube channel. In this video, we are reviewing crochet hair from another vendor on Amazon Prime. And we are reviewing their Spring Twist Ombre Crochet Hair in the color T1B30. Without further ado, let's check out this crochet hair. Okay, so the only item that came in this order was the hair. Nothing more, nothing less. Just the hair. That's fine. You pay for literally what you get and that is quite alright. Let's take a look at one of these bundles. Alright, let's get started. So the first topic is initial shedding. Each strand is a crochet strand. Now, we can totally comb out the coils, but that will completely change the hair pattern essentially. That is a completely different hairstyle. So in its normal form, there is no tangles. There's not going to be tangles because each of each hair strand is in the spring twist, is in the coil. So unless you physically comb your fingers through the hair, you will have some hair strands fall out because you combed out the hair from its normal pattern. So at that point, you would have shedding. But right now, everything is connected. Like the hair strands are individually made into one. So there's not going to be any shedding for this kind of hair. Not in its normal appearance, right? Next topic is true to length. Each hair strand is supposed to be eight inches long. So we can actually pull one of the hair strands from the bundle and double check that length. So I have a hair strand hanging freely. The 16 inch mark is right here. So gravity might be working with this particular hair strand, but it does technically pass the 16 inch mark. Half of 16 is eight inches. So we can go ahead and give them a point for true to length because overall this hair strand does pass 16 inches. So it's fair to say that each hair strand is eight inches. Okay, so the next topic is smell. This hair smells like a brown paper bag. Whatever synthetic hair that they use to make this crochet hair, it smells like a brown paper bag. It doesn't smell bad to me though. I don't think it smells bad at all. It just smells like a brown paper bag. So if you are okay with that, then you know. I'm okay with it. It doesn't smell bad at least, so kudos to that. Texture, the hair texture is actually fairly smooth, you know? It doesn't feel dry and it doesn't feel crunchy, so that's really good. I don't feel like the hair texture would irritate my skin at all, so kudos to that. Volume, now, volume, we cannot deny the volume. Like, this hair is jumping, okay? And it's jumping high. Okay, there's lots of volume in this itty bitty bundle. Oh my goodness. This would be perfect to put on little kids. Like, I would definitely purchase this in 1B. This is definitely kid friendly. But anyways, definitely has nice volume. Like this hair is super perky, super bouncy, super coily. I love it, I love it. And again, the vendor calls this hair pattern spring twist. Definitely spring-like, definitely in a coil. Tangles, again, there aren't going to be any tangles unless you create them. Right now, the hair are in its little coils. So it probably will tangle because it is synthetic and it is curly if you were to try to separate them. If you do plan to separate them, of course, start from the hair ends and work your way up. Don't separate from the top because it will definitely turn into a nest, okay? If you don't detangle it correctly. So this is definitely capable of having tangles. So you would have to create the tangles, okay? But as far as initially, no tangles. I can get to each strand without a problem they're not tangling together so this is tangle free and the hair ends the hair ends look good I will say a few of the hair ends are not a hundred percent coiled some of the hair ends are loose I will definitely give you a little zoom in on the hair end so you can see what I'm talking about but for the most part the hair ends are perfectly coiled so I will let them slide on the hair ends the hair ends are okay we can let them slide you see how the hair ends are coming undone a couple stragglers so what we can do for all of them that kind of look like this is 
cut it off. Easy as that, just cut it and then problem solved. So I'm not going to knock off a point for that because I know I can just cut it. So we let them slide this time, just this time. So this bundle in particular came with 14 strands. So they gave us six bags of crochet hair. Not sure if that's going to be enough. You would have to evenly distribute 14 strands. This is folded in half, so you're going to crochet the hair in at this point. So it's going to look like each section has 28 strands when it's really 14 strands. So you have to separate the section and spread out the hair accordingly just to make sure that your head looks full in that section because you don't want to look crazy and then you don't want to buy more hair and you definitely don't want to start over. So just saying. So overall, I'm rating this crochet hair a 10 out of 10. Honestly, there isn't anything wrong with this crochet hair. Like how this crochet hair appears is how I would expect it to look so I think that this will be a great hairstyle for a little kid I love the hair ends like this little pop of color is just enough for me okay it's just enough you guys know how I feel about color but this is just enough I will definitely rock this in a very cute hairstyle for sure just that little pop of color but definitely for sure I would say this is kid friendly this crochet hair would be super cute for kids but yeah, that is all for this video. I hope that it was helpful. Give this video a thumbs up and comment down below in the comments. And be sure to subscribe to Slade Secrets YouTube channel. Until next time, I will see you in the next video. Bye.